always wanted to create a video regarding of this because sometimes you can see that you have parts that are maybe thin wall or maybe never join properly and you may have issue that the part will just like wobbly crack off pulling pulling so i'm going to teach you a simple thing that we are using autodesk mesh mixer right now i'm going to import this file you can try yourself to print but i'm sure that this file actually is not joined properly and when you print it will just come off how can we see whether the part is it good or not autodesk have provide this um, mesh mixer for us and you can see it having the irregular pixels so what we are going to do is that we're going to solidify it and maintain the actual dimensions of this file okay so i just turn off this wireframe mode we shall get into it so we go into edit and make solid so when we make solid do you realize that um, it may kill off some of the print and it's not so beautiful there's a few things that we can go into it like we can change the accuracy then we create more solid accuracy and increase the mesh brush the thickness we can change it to maybe 0 0.1 so at least it maintain the thickness of it then right now i shall update it may take some time depend on how big your file is so sometimes it may take one two minutes or maybe it will take you know longer 10 minutes 20 minutes also depends on your computer your ram whether is it good or not so this software really help out help a lot in our print i remember the first time i print this pencil holder it was just like when i take out from my print and just crack off then right now i just use this simple step and you can just print it and use it after we've done all this repair sorry that it, sometimes but let's intro this um website actually it'll be nice that you can come here and you know check out because there are a lot of nice prints that you can go into it and it's really very beautiful like all this architecture how they design and print some may need to pay and some you may need to spend a bit of money but you can just you know post your design over here and you are selling it to the world right now there are some profit popular things in singapore like the nerve group so they are talking about all the nerve gun etc yeah you see one design can cost you three dollars and some even free so really depends you can come over here and take a look there are a lot of professional they have done this hmm. and even there are a lot of handphones there. Or maybe 
we can have some nice thing. Yeah, this is the design that I'm trying right now. And even for jewelry casting, you can come here and take a look what they have over here. For people who are going into racing, you can go along and download and print. Let's see. Oh. Our pin is going to finish. Hmm. Okay, it takes some time. because it's quite a big file Once this is complete and the file will be ready. Yeah, they also will check all the error. You see? It preserve the origin layout and it's beautiful and solid now. So for us that we hate all the mesh all the mess in the print we don't want to have any bad print this is one of the steps you should come into so once you are done and you click accept then you go to file you export export please the file to a SDL file then we can give it a name so that's all simple as that because if you save the file it will be under the mesh file so unless you export it then it will be under the SDL. That's all.